Okay guys, good morning. This is Clark Benoya. <laughs> Medyo sleepy kahit pa. And today is Sunday. Early morning and Sunday. And I will go out. Sama ko si Coach JC to get his own camera for his own online content. Very excited. Punta kami alabang to meet the seller. Ito ang camera niya. At we'll check out kung ano yung camera na makukuha niya. At okay, basta. Grogi pa ako, kahigilip ka lang. It's almost 6.30 in the morning. Tara, pala tayo sa meeting place. Oh, by the way, don't forget, safety first. Let's wear a mask. Si Coach. Oh, ito na kami excited na to get his first camera. <laughs> wow! Well, the reason why I got this guy is because he's an expert. So, I want to be sure that I'm getting a, a good buy. <laughs> Hindi good buy. Diba? Hindi good buy. <laughs> but thank you bro for the time. Yeah. I know na busy because da bagong daddy eh. So, hiniram ko muna Len, pansamantala. <laughs> But at least, uh, it will be good catching up, no? Uh, yes, three yes, months, yes. brother! Yes, Coach, three months. Simula talaga nung nag-lockdown. Actually, dahil lang ko lang yung, ano, yung pagkuha ng camera. Gusto talaga ito makausap. Eh. Date talaga ito. Ah! <laughs> so, ano ang, um, ano ang paalam mo sa iyong uh, pamilya? Well, totoo naman yung sinabi ko na talagang sasamahan ko kayo, Coach, to get your first camera, to check it out. <laughs> As in, talagang parang, kung parang, parang bibili ka ng bago sa sakyan, di ba? Kailangan mo ng parang mechanic or someone na <laughs> kayang tignan in detail. So, sabi, sabi sama ko na si Coach. Sabi niya, ano oras? Sabi ko, 6 a.m. Sugado ka? Sugado. <laughs> <laughs> Kasi, Coach, talagang gising namin. Dahil usually, gising si Claude hanggang 2-3 a.m. Eh, oh, or nagigising siya. So, ano ka? Kula ka sa tulog? Okay lang yan, Coach. Sunday oh. naman eh. Oh, yeah. dire diretso to kasama na Sunday service, Sunday activity. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I discovered that the person that we gonna go to is a pastor. <laughs> oh, so parang uh, of course I'm always ano, eh, praying to the Lord na di ba when you purchase, hindi lang siya basta bumili ka lang eh. Yes, You're yes, also yes. getting it from another person. So, yon, uh nagaan pa ko ng mga ano, mga things to even more consider. Syempre, Anyway, parang when I, I was looking for a camera, that's the time na nag-research lang ako, tapos sa research ko, talagang yun lang yung lumabas eh. Tapos pag-click ko, may number, I um, inquired. Pero eventually, parang ano siya eh, eager din siya. So parang, ah, oh, okay, sige, tingnan natin. Tapos usap kami ulit, ayun, nagkaintindihan na kami. Sa signal lang namin pala. Hindi lang dahil sa lingwahe niya. <laughs> signal din. <laughs> And then, ano ba bang nangyari? Um, I asked, I know, ask him to send photos. Tapos parang yung photos is, is a way for me to look into the ano, itsura, di ba? Parang sa una. Basta, syempre, mm -hmm. yun yung external eh. Yung internal, ayan, uh, that's the reason why, ang una kagad pumasok sa isip ko, naku, pag bibiling ko to, kailangan ko nang merong titingin, no? Another person, di ba? Sa, o, ano nga, doktor, di ba? Second opinion, third opinion. Ito, first opinion ko agad, Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. Wala nang iba. <laughs> no, but because, uh, hindi lang dahil ikaw yung kakilala ko, pero because you are already, ano eh, um, established when it comes to this industry. So, ba't ka palalayo? Di ba? Number one, sino yung expert? Number two, sino yung kakilala mo? Number three, sino yung... Uy... We willing sumama sa iyo. Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. <laughs> oh, so, <laughs> and you have all the no? you have all the the qualities brother kaya pasado ka. Thank you sa trust. Oh. Dahil doon, dahil doon brother. <laughs> ikaw ang magbabayad joke lang. <laughs> sa inyo yung phone. Ay, sa inyo ano. Uh, camera. So I'm getting a GH4. Uh, Panasonic Lumix. And just to those of you who are going to see this video, <laughs> ang idea nung uh, nakuha ko yon because NAS Daily or some mm -hmm. people in NAS Academy are actually using it. So I got initially first to see Sony XV1 and pang vlogger talaga siya, content creators. Pero ang 
Ang sinadya sa akin ng instructor namin, if you are going for the long run, parang long run, long term, at mapwede kang mag-professional, dito ka na lang sa GH. So, of course, maraming mga brands, no? But syempre sila, they can only recommend what they're using. Uh, na Nasir Usain, which, which is Nas Daily, is using GH5. So, yun. At least yun yung mga considerations ko. Uh, for the longest time, I've been using my phone. I, uh, yun lang, kasi yun yung pinaka-portable. Eh. Pero yun na nga, if I'm really getting into the blogging sphere or content creation, at least investment na rin. Yeah, double check ko, baka may mamali tayo, Clark. <laughs> Sa iba tayo mapunta ko siya. Uh Oo. -oh. But thank you, brother. No worries, coach. Yes. This is one of the first journey together. <laughs> ah, talaga ba? Yeah. Oh, kanawin mo kasi, di ba? Sabay lang. Yes, gamay. Pura ganun naman tayo madala si Drop Off. Uh -oh. <laughs> so, Clark and I uh, serves at the feast. No? This is a uh, charismatic community. But of course, because of the lockdown, ayan, hindi kami makapag-serve ngayon. So, we're doing more online. Yeah. In fact, uh, uh, as of this recording, uh, this is a morning uh, travel, pero maya maya ang konte. Ano, meron kami service, no? Yes. Online ang service natin. Online service. Oh, <laughs> Apart from uh, your skill of a photographer, you're now learning how to become a vlogger or a content creator yes. and that's the those are the skills or those are the careers that you want to consider in the new normal kaya ko eh, I'm really advocating yung um, new skills for the new normal so yeah. writing, blogging speaking yun yung mga bagay na dapat uh, meron tayo or matutunan natin JC. Oh yeah. Nice, nice. Good to see you. Yeah. Alright. Ready ka na ako? Chopo ko yung kamera mo. Well, um, you need to invest in yourself. Eh? So part of that is gears, tools. Mm -hmm. So hindi lang naman yung learning. Tama. So at least I'll be able to. Uh, really apply and use. No? Majority of my classmates in the academy are using talagang ano eh, camera, DSLR, mirrorless. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so finally got my GH4 Panasonic together with my friend Clark helping me out to have a look at it. At uh, mukhang pumasa naman kay Clark. So yeah. ano masasabi mo Clark? Okay ako. Uh, I envy you, Coach, <laughs> for having a GH4. Perfect, <laughs> guys. Sana dumating din yun tayo na GH5 or something like this din yung hawak ko ngayon pinangre-record ta. Pwede nga na eh. We work with what we have. Yeah. Sige, I'll use this. We work with what we have and then along the way, we will upgrade. Mm -hmm. Diba? That is when we're already earning and monetizing. So, at least ito is sa mga unang investment. So is it a mirrorless or a diesel? Mirrorless. Mirrorless. Wow. Okay. So yeah, pang vlogging naren, pang photography naren. So, yep. Anyway, um, ako ang isa sa mga pinakamahalaga ng pinangawag ko ngayon is that I started with phones. No, this is like this one I'm using. So hopefully I can get uh, uh, to create more content that will add value to people as I upgrade. And then hindi lang naman yung sa gears, no? Pero Sometimes you balance it rin yun eh, na dapat yung content mo is good enough. So, you have a great content, you have great uh, gears, then when you put that together, that really creates impact out there. So, yeah. Anyway, it's just a short video. Thankful again to this guy, Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. Clark Vinoya. And to that guy earlier, si Sha, no? Uh, nakakatawa lang, uh, Clark, is that uh, we were able to also have some alignment because he's also in the ministry, he's a pastor, Adventist pastor. And the reason why he's, uh, he's uh, selling this is because he needs the money 
para makapag-aral siya pang tuition niya. And in my case naman, uh, gagamitin ko siya for what I do sa ministry, also in content creation. Tapos ito, this very own uh, camera, uh, is also, was used, no? Was used actually for the ministry, for the mission. So, ang ganda lang. Ang ganda ng fit. And then, yeah. So, really excited, no? As we continue to um, create more content. Yay! Congratulations! Pero ka bang few words? Closing words? I, en I envy you, coach! <laughs> <laughs> Let's create more content! Oh, yun, yun ang pinakamaganda. Oh, sige, pakita natin pareho tayo merong Merong ano, may mga gears. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Photography preaching! So there you have it. So apparently, I am a video mm. ng seller si Chak. He's a Korean. And also, he's an Adventist pastor. <laughs> so, we're here na. Pa-uwi na. At, excited si Coach sa camera niya. Yeah, <laughs> mag-picture tayo ulit. Nagkaroon kami ng quick, uh, quick na crash pa, na crash course. Sa, sa harap anong meeting spot before kami umalis. So, sana na may natutunan sa akin si Coach paano gamitin yung camera. Yeah, of course! <laughs> Brother, kaya ikaw nga ang sinama ko. Clark Binoya? Clark Binoya? Clark Binoya? So, pareho kaming walang mga pangalan ng... <laughs> okay, 5, 4, 3, 2... Yay! Okay. Alright, thank you, Lord. Time to go home. Yes. Bye. 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 So, okay, we're home. Whew. Grabe ang init sa labas. Palit na ako ng damit kasi outside closure suot ko kanina. So, na-excite ako sa magiging collaboration namin ni Coach JC. And of course, I'm happy for his new camera. Okay, ngayon, question is, is it still worth it to have this Lubix GH4? So let's have a check kung ano man yung specs na itong camera na to. Six years after siyang may labas. So year 2014 nung lumabas yung camera, it was May 2014 nung nai-release ito. And this camera has a micro four-third image sensor. So meaning mas maliit pa to sa mga crop sensor. But, ito, take note of this guys. It can record a video in 96 FPS frame per second at 1080. So imagine ano yung slow-mo shots na pwede mo magawa rito at 1080. And it can record at 4K in 30 frame per second. GH4 is wala siyang, image wala siyang built in image stabilizer. But since it is very lightweight, you can use a gimbal for it. At isa pang advantage nito is flip screen. So very useful for vlogging. At meron din siyang focus speaking. Focus speaking, ito yung pag naka-live screen siya at managpo-focus ka, makikita mo kung saan naka-focus yung lens mo, yung camera mo. So, hindi ka na mga nga pa kung naka-focus ba to sa subject mo or sa, sa focus point mo. So, by looking at the peaking points, makikita mo agad kung naka-focus siya. At meron din siya tinatawag na zebra exposure. So, zebra exposure, ito yung makikita mo meron siyang mga zebra lines or diagonal lines. Itong nga diagonal lines ito, it's nag-indicate kung meron kang highlights or overexposed do sa frame mo. Very useful siya, especially in setting your exposure right. And since 6 years ago pa siya na-release, GH4 is cheaper today compared nung una siyang lang labas niya that year. And so na-mention nga kanina, this is a micro third image sensor. But match it with the right lens, still you can produce a quality photo and video. Ito, I have a first hand feedback, I asked my friend, a cinematographer friend in one big studio. His name is Ryan Nakario. So, ito yung feedback niya. He is a user of GH4. Currently, ito yung ginagamit pa rin nila sa si studio nila for their films, for their videos na ginagawa, for their contents. So, according to him, quote, the camera is very ergonomic, the buttons are where you expect them to be, and the button layout is very intuitive. Same goes for the menu too. I think it is essential that you go for speed booster or a lens adapter at least. Well, for vlogging naman pala, so the, the portability of native lenses is very attractive. End quote. GH4 is very lightweight. So, para kay, kay Coach JC, magagamit at very useful sa kanya ito dahil napakagaan. Even yung lens na nakabit sa camera nung binili namin, uh, the previous owners using a Tamron lens. So, very lightweight at ang gaan na ito talaga. So, 
So with these details, with this information, with this review, the answer for our question, is it good? Is it still good to have GH4 in this time? Well, definitely the answer is yes. So that's my personal opinion. GH4 is still useful during this time. So are you a previous owner of GH4? If yes, so I'm inviting you to comment down below and let us know your thoughts about the GH4. So that's it for today. It's been a long video. It's been a long journey. If you like this episode, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring that bell to get notified on my next videos. See you on my next vlog. Okay. 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 Okay.